I always knew I wanted to do something that was hands-on. Um, I originally thought I was going to be an auto mechanic. I always thought an auto mechanic, what I learned about an auto mechanic is that's more of a hobby for me, it's not a career. What I really want to do is design and have the flexibility and control to create what I want, uh, which then led me down the engineering path. I decided to go into this field as basically I wanted to make a difference. Um, I had a real passion for uh, machining and fabricating along with uh, making process improvements. So improving the day-to-day -day lives of the assemblers and the fabricators that are out on the plant. I decided to go into this field because in high school I actually had a couple of classes that allowed you to work with simple machines and we had robotics clubs and things like that that really gave you hands-on technology experience. Well, what really kind of solidified it for me is it's a very promising field as far as the options you have where you can go with it. And it's interesting. You know, you talk to people and, you know, if they have a job they really enjoy, it's because it's interesting. It challenges them, you know, not to the point that, you know, they, they can't do their job. But um, it's something different. It's not monotonous. And, I mean, there really is a high job demand for any kind of engineering related field. Trying to choose my degree was actually pretty complicated for me. In high school, I didn't have a good idea of what I wanted to do, so I got a lot of advice from some of my advisors. They told me I was good at math and science. Pinpointing industrial engineering had so many different things that you could do just within that field alone. Uh, with the lean, the quality, the process improvement stuff, it just had so many different things that you could accelerate in. I decided to become an engineer because I always enjoyed figuring out how things worked and I always loved problem solving so I figured engineering was uh, the best field for that. Out of high school I was the typical guy that didn't know what I wanted to do, didn't know if I wanted to go to a four-year school, a two-year school, go to the military. Took a tour of the tech colleges, found that the engineering came easy. Manufacturing has always intrigued me. I've always uh, had a passion for seeing how something's made from the beginning all the way to the end. Here in, at Miller Electric, we get to see that. We have steel that comes in flat on a pickup truck, um, all the way up to a finished welder at the end of the day going out to customers. I like tinkering around. Uh, since I was a kid, I used to make my own toys like cars, planes, and stuff like that. Just model cars, which is still my hobby today. So I thought mechanical engineering would be perfect for me. I decided to go into manufacturing engineering because I like variety. And uh, I like, I'm more of a hands-on type person. I'm not one that likes to sit at a computer and draw and design. I decided I wanted to be an engineer when in the eighth grade I went to a class field trip in Washington, D.C. and we visited the Smithsonian Air and Space Museum and it was the coolest thing that I had ever seen, still is the coolest place I've ever been, and I decided that I wanted to work with airplanes from that moment on.